This video is on Poisson distribution. In today's video, I'm going to teach a problem that is the average number of phone calls per minute coming into a switchboard between 2 p.m. and 4 p.m. is 2.5. Here, the average number is given as 2.5, which means mean, mean lambda is given as 2.5. Now, we have to determine the probability that during one particular minute, there will be four or fewer and the next one more than six calls. So, let's get started to solve this problem. First thing here is the average number of phone calls. So, here the mean man value, the mean lambda is given as 2.5. And after that, we have to find the probability that during one particular minute, there will be four or fewer. So, four or fewer means the first solution here is four or fewer. The probability that there will be four or fewer calls means that is probability of uh, x less than or equal to 4. 4 or fewer. That is probability of x is equal to 0 plus probability of x is equal to 1 plus probability of uh, x is equal to 2 plus probability of x is equal to 3 plus probability of x is equal to 4. Here we have to consider this 0 as r. Here R value as 1 and here R value as 2, 3 and 4. And now if I use this Poisson distribution. So what is this Poisson distribution? According to the Poisson distribution, P of X is equal to R is E power minus lambda. This is lambda power R by R factorial. Now if I substitute in this formula, then see what happens here. So here R value is 0. So, if I substitute lambda is already, this is 2.5 from the question. That is e power minus 2.5. This is 2.5 power 0 by 0 factorial. Plus, if r value is equal to, if I take 1, that is e power minus 2.5. This is 2.5 power 1 by 1 factorial. And if I take r is equal to 2, this is e power minus 5. 2.5 whole square by 2 factorial and if I take r as 3 that is e power minus 25 2.5 whole cube by 3 factorial plus e power minus 2.5 this is 2.5 power 4 by this is 4 factorial. So in this case if I take e power minus 2.5 common e power minus 2.5 common. So, this value is anything to the power of 0 is 1 and 0 factorial is again 1. That is 1 plus this is 2.5 power 1 by 1 factorial. This is 2.5 whole square by 2 factorial. This is 2.5 whole cube by 3 factorial and this is 2.5 whole power 4 by this value is 4 factorial. Now, if I solve this, let's see the value will be. So, this will be e power minus 2.5. This is 1 plus this value is 2.5 and the next thing here is 2.5 whole square that is 2.5 square divided by 2. The value is 3.125. So, this value is 3.125 and the next one is 2.5. 2.5 whole cube divided by 3 factorial means 6. So, the value here is 2.6041 plus this value is 2.5 power 4 divided by 4 factorial 1 into 2 into 3 into 4 which is equal to 24. So, this value is 1.6276. So, see here if I add up all these values then what will be the value? See, this is 1 plus 2.5, 1 plus 2.5 plus 3.125 plus 2.6041 plus that is 1.6276. So, this is 10 point. So, the value here is e power minus 2.5 into 10 point that is a567. So, if I multiply this one with e power minus 2.5, the value here is 0 point. So, the value here is 0 0.891172. That is the probability of x less than or equal to 4. So, therefore, the probability of getting 
four or fewer calls see what is the probability that during one particular minute there will be four or fewer calls so the value here is zero point this is zero point eight nine double one seven two and the next question is more than six calls so here we have to find out the second solution is more than six calls again our lambda value is same thing that is 2.5 from the question and uh, here so we have to find this is the solution too that is the probability that during one particular time there will be more than six calls more than six calls means probability of p greater than six so which means that so it is easier to solve like one minus probability of x less than or equal to 6 that is see here if I substitute here so that is 1 minus this way is probability of x is equal to 0 plus probability of x is equal to 1 plus probability of x is equal to 2 plus probability of x is equal to 3 plus probability of x is equal to 4 plus probability of x is equal to 5 plus probability of x is equal to 6. So now we have to solve this. So according to the Poisson distribution, we have a formula that P of x is equal to R is equal to E power minus lambda, lambda power R by R factorial. Here our R value is 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and 6. If I substitute in the formula, then this will be 1 minus. So E power minus lambda, that is E power minus 2.5 this is 2.5 power 0 by 0 factorial and this is e power minus 2.5 this is 2.5 power 1 by 1 factorial plus e power minus 2.5 that is 2.5 whole square by 2 factorial plus this is e power this is minus 2.5 this is 2.5 whole cube by 3 factorial plus e power minus 2.5 this is 2.5 power 4 by 4 factorial plus e power minus 2.5 this is 2.5 whole power 5 by 5 factorial plus this value is e power minus 2.5 this is 2.5 power 6 by 6 factorial see here so if i take if i take e power minus 2.5 common so this will be so this will be anything to the power of 0 is 1 so this is 2.5 and this value is 2.5 whole square by 2 factorial and see this is 2.5 whole cube by 1 into 2 into 3 this value is 6 and the next one the value here is 2.5 whole power 4 by 1 into 2 into 3 into 4 this is 24 2.5 whole power 5 by 1 into 2 into 3 into 4 into 5 this value is 120 this is 2.5 whole power 6 divided by into 6 that is 6 factorial this is a 720 so now we need all these values see this will be 1 minus e power minus 2.5 this is 1 plus 2.5 plus see here this is 2.5 into 2.5 divided by 2 the value here is 3.125 and the next one is 2.5 whole cube divided by 6 the value here is 2.60416 and the next one here is 2.5 power 4 divided by 24 the value here is this is 1.62760 plus this value is 2.5 power 5 divided by the value here is 120 this is 0 0.813802 plus this is 2.5 power 6 divided by the value is 720 see the value that is 0 0.339084 so if i add all these values see here this will be 1 plus 2.5 plus 3.125 plus this value is 2.60416 plus this is 1.62760 plus this is 0. this is 81382 plus 
zero point three three nine zero eight four. If I add all these values, so this is nothing but one minus e power minus two point five into this is twelve point zero zero nine six four six. This is into see here into e power minus two point five into minus one plus one. The value here is zero point. See here, the value here is zero point zero. One four one double eight two two four, and this is how we have to solve. And this is nothing but the probability of getting more than six calls. That is the probability of getting more than six calls is nothing but zero point zero one four one eight 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 two two four. Thank you so much for watching. And this is how we have to solve. If we have lambda value, and see here, the average number. Whenever the average number is given, we have to consider that the mean value is given as two point five. And next, we have to determine the probability that during a particular minute there will be four or fewer or more than six calls. Four or fewer means x less than or equal to four. Till four, we have to calculate, and this is the answer for that. That is zero point eight nine double one six two. And more than six calls. See, instead of doing more than six calls, I am subtracting from one minus probability of x less than or equal to six. And that value is zero point zero one four. This is zero point zero one four one eight. And thank you so much for watching. And this is this is uh, it for today.